Hammond Report. This is John Hammond, the organ player and accordionist. And I'm back with my daily Hammond Report for Saturday, January 9th of 2021. Thank you very much, folks, for joining me once again for some more of my music and stories. Well, it's been a a hell of a week. They say this is the week that shook the world, but we're not out of the woods yet. 11 days and change until the big presto change don't you know me? Uh, I was tell my girlfriend thanks God we're musicians and the music never goes anywhere and I'm really very blessed and fortunate to have it in me, in me and in my fingers. I don't sing. I always say the fingers of the singers. On guitar, that's Joe Burger, aka the Burgermeister, doing a little morning session here at the Hammond Suzuki stand. Real traditional thing we do on the last day of the Nam show. We got a Nam coming right up. It's going to be the first ever virtual NAMM show. So we'll see um, what they're calling Believe in Music Week TV. And I guess that means it's going to be an entire week. And I do believe in music. And it's going to be on TV. And uh, speaking of TV... I was on TV this morning, 1.30 in the morning, and it's my 37th year on cable access TV in Manhattan. And this day I want to say a very sad goodbye to my dear friend and uh, big inspirator, Harold Channer, Harold Hudson Channer. He passed, I found out. For sure, last night on New Year's Eve. And Harold, one of the pioneers of public access TV, deep thinker, doer. So I send my deepest condolences to Maggie and Harold's entire family and all the friends and colleagues at. MNN TV, Manhattan Neighborhood Network. And I'm going to keep his shows going. Harold was the longest cable access producer. And I think I was just in, in behind him. I've been on 37 years now. And I know Harold was on this 39, if not 40. But, uh, he left a treasure trove of interviews. His show called Conversations with Harold Channer, and I was in some beautiful conversations with Harold. He's one of our good friends from Suzuki Musical Instruments. Yeah. It was always fun to meet and play for the folks who designed the instruments that I play. I always say it doesn't say Hammond on that. I'm not interested in playing it. Unless it's a cordine. I played cordine for a long time too. I play Excelsior now. Taking you home with this one. Folks, have a beautiful weekend. Come back tomorrow. I'll have a, another Hammond report for you every day until the pandemic is over. Yeah, I just want to say one last thing on this cadenza E flat. Seven nine with 
the flat something. <laughs> and that is bye bye now.